Hey, hey, everyone, welcome back to A Living Color TV. I'm your host, Alexis Monet. And before we get started, make sure you all hit that like, share, subscribe, and hit that bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. Okay, everyone, so if you don't know, Nicki Minaj did drop a video for fans who did pre order Pink Friday, too. And if you didn't see the video, check this out. I'm gonna give other things because every Friday from now until November 17th when the album comes out is. So I have to give, you know, treats, uh, you know, music, um, uh, announcements, stuff like that. Um, so yeah, Patty, do you have any questions that you think the barbs want to ask me? And first and foremost, let me just say I am a bad I mean, shit, that's a... Uh... What is the feeling of this album going to be like? What could they expect the feeling to be at this joint right here? Uh, full circle. Full circle. Like if you... That's dope. Have you been... Now I'm very excited that Nikki continues to drop videos and little teasers and snippets of what we can expect from Pink Friday too. And the good news is we don't have that much longer to wait. November 17th is quickly approaching. Now moving along to the next topic. Now Drake did release his new album for all the dogs. Now a few weeks ago he did announce during his tour that Nicki Minaj would be featured on his new project. However, when the album was released a lot of fans and barbs noticed that Nicki Minaj was not featured. And some people are upset, some fans are saying that Drake used Nicki and the barbs in order to promote his new album but it may be that Drake is featured on Nicki's upcoming album Pink Friday 2 and they're just saving that song for her project. Some fans believe that Drake may have removed Nicki from his album because he is cool with Offset and Offset and Nicki Minaj's husband Kenneth Petty do have some sort of beef going on at the moment. So maybe Drake didn't want to be a part of the drama and he may want to separate himself from all of it. But I'm going to hold off on my conclusion and opinion until Pink Friday 2 comes out because we can all be wrong and Nicki and Drake are just fine and maybe they're just saving the song for another project. But we'll just have to wait and see. Now moving along to the final topic, Cardi B. Now over the weekend, the BET Hip Hop Awards did happen and Cardi B was one of the most nominated artists this year. And on the red carpet, a lot of female rappers were asked to recite their favorite Cardi B verse. And some of those female rappers were Suki Hana, Scarlett, Lola Brooke, and even Little Tay. Now what I did find interesting is a lot of the girls recited Cardi B's verse from tomorrow too which in my opinion that's one of cardi's best verses today but you let me know how you feel about these topics down below thanks again for joining me for another video and until next time bye